This your boy Thomas Lee, aka Shariba, coming to you from Troopian Village Live with an interview with my boy Bishop. You know, a new up and coming artist here in the high desert, reside in the uh, city of Barstow. Tell me something about yourself. You know, I've been in the game for a little while since like 2003. Me and my boy Gambino been putting it down out there. You know, shout out to Gambino. You know. So, like, uh, you know, your inspiration. What are some of the inspirations that you, you know, what I mean, had to put you into the game? You know what I mean? Uh, you know, who are you really feeling that's, you know, out there or, or, or who, you know what I mean, motivated you to come out? Coming up as a shorty, you know, I listen to uh, Young Mouth, you know what I'm saying, Corrupt, um, Dad's the Dog Pound, you know, um, a little bit of Biggie, you know, I like that East Coast flavor too, but uh, I'm a West Coast dude. Yeah, so, I mean, like, you know, uh, a lot of, you know, there, there's a lot of controversy in the sense of saying, you know, we as young black men, you know what I mean, we are in a challenging uh, situation, circumstance as far as, you know, our existence here in America. You know, do you have, do you feel any responsibility for the music that you put out? Do you, you know what I mean, do you try to, you know, not only entertain, but educate? Oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Most definitely. Um, like I said, I'm all around versatile. I got uh, music for the kids, the females, you know what I'm saying, especially for the ladies. I got you. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm responsible for everything I put out, for sure. So, uh, you know what I mean, uh, where you see yourself at in like, you know, five years from now, or what would you like to see yourself at in five years? And what is your plan on, you know, what are the steps, stages, and degrees that you, you know, have uh, sketched out for yourself, you know, and, and making your career happen? Well, hopefully, you know, right now I'm working on an album. So in the next five years, hopefully I should have about two or three of them out, you know. I got a lot of mixtapes, I got a lot of music I'm sitting on right now. I just want to get it out there, man, for the people, that, you know what I'm saying? Embrace it, you know what I'm saying? Enjoy it, hear it, you know what I mean? Love it, you feel me? Do you consider yourself to be an underground artist or, or, or how, you know what I mean? I, I know you, we've talked prior to this interview, you know, uh, a lot of people want to speak to the streets, you know what I mean? Uh, you know. Uh, you know, what is your, you know, intent as far as speaking to the street? I mean, what kind of, you know, message do you have for the street? Well, you know, it, it, it's gangster rap, but like I said, I'm all around versatile. I'm gonna have somebody, something for everybody on the album. Um, um, I'm independent, of course, underground artist, yes. Um, and I think I think the streets gonna love it, man. I'm gonna heat them up. This, this album is coming, uh, first and last term coming soon. Y'all cop that. That's the name of the album? Yeah, yeah. I mean, like, if people want to, you know what I mean, find you on, on, on the internet, you know, how can they find you? Um, well, right now, it's, uh, um, I'm at a lot of little record shops locally. You can pick that album up coming soon, like I said, first and last term. Um, it, I'm, I'm all over the radio, so you don't hear me. Um, my email is uh, jjohnson at yahoo.com. Y'all can get at me on there. And, um, that's about it right now. So you're going uh, to do a song for us? What is the song you're going to do for us? Yeah, yeah it's called uh, Too Late. It's a little love song. I wrote it for a little female, but you know, I'm sure all the females can relate to it and they're going to feel it. So how old is you, brother? I mean, like, you know. You... I'm 29 right now. Man. 29? 29. Man, you look pretty good for 29, man. Thank you. Thank you. Man, you got your kids? What? Yeah, I got one little girl and a little daughter. Is that right? Yeah. How old is your daughter? She's five. She's five right now. Five? Yeah, she out there in D-Town, Detroit. Shout out to Detroit. Is that where you're from, Detroit? No, nah, no, nah, I'm originally from Compton. I was born at uh, King Drew Medical Center. You know what I'm saying? Killer Kill King? Yeah, Killer King, man. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah. what, what part of Compton? Uh, um, Rosecrans, Rosecrans and Camp. Ain't, ain't nothing wrong, you know, sometimes it's not where you're from, it's where you're at, man. It's, you know what I mean? You gotta, you know, get down where you're at, you did? Yep, yep. You know, for sure. Know. So that's all good. What's, what, what's going on in Barstow, man? You know, they got any clubs, they got any, what's the scene? Um, they got that little shooters. Um, it was, it was Ruby's, then they changed the shooters, then they moved into the bowling alley. So it's shooters now, they at the bowling alley, you know. Is, is it cracking with days? Is it cracking? Yeah, it's cracking, uh, I say weekends, Friday and Saturday is the most cracking days. Well, you got any folks that you want to give shout outs to? Just, just my boy Gambino, shout out Gambino, shout out to 36, you know what I'm saying? And uh, shout out to the fam, fam bam, that's about it. Inside up. 
Is that east side of uh, uh, Barstow? Yeah, you know, east side of Barstow. To Los Angeles, you know. Ain't, ain't nothing wrong with it. I mean, you know, as long as, you know, I mean, you know, we are from where we are, you know what I mean? But at the same time, you know, that's not to say that we can't have relationships yeah. with, you know, other parts of town. Yeah. You know what I mean? Get our vibe on, groove on, you know what I mean? Yeah. And it's all about, you know what I mean? You know, love, you know, one love, you yeah. know what I mean? You know where one love come from? Where they come from, the bay? Well, you know, one love, you know, kind of like represents, you know, we as a people as being black, you know what I mean? It's one love, you know what I mean? Yeah. So when people say one love, uh -huh. you know, it's, it means black love, you know what I mean? One, you know, it's you know, yeah. like yeah. we all family. Sure, yeah. sure. Yeah. So, all the time, all the time. Well, I mean, it was a pleasure. We're going to... Uh, we're going to listen to what you got, you know what I mean? Listen to the songs you're going to put out, you know what I mean? I appreciate, you know what I mean, you coming to the True Being Village studio, you know what I mean, giving this interview and, you know, let people know where you at, where you from, you know what I mean, and what you got to represent. You know what I mean? Thank you. 